Hi guys, Ron here, and I'm back with an all-new ranking video, and this time I'm uh, ranking the uh, Carrie movies, which ones I think are excellent, which ones I think that are just uh, good. First up is the original classic from 1976, and everyone knows how good this is. This was... Stephen King's first novel that was made into a movie and this was directed by Brian De Palma and the performances in this movie are great uh, <clears throat> from Piper Laurie as uh, Sissy Spacek's religious fanatic mother uh, Amy Irving, uh, William Catt, Nancy Allen to uh, Sissy Spacek as the uh, title character and uh, it, of course, it's uh, really slow uh, halfway through the movie, but it starts to build up through the uh, prom scene, which is pretty iconic, with the uh, split screen uh, scene with the prom and the uh, slow motion shots with uh, Amy Irving uh, coming into the prom to try to warn uh, <coughs> Betty Buckley's uh, character uh, about uh, Nancy Allen and John Travolta under the uh, bleachers, I mean, under the stage. And also uh, PJ Souls as uh, Norma Watson with the uh, red hat is uh, pretty good in it. And uh, a little nasty. And uh, the score is excellent. And so I give this like five stars. Next up is uh, The Rage Carry 2 from 1999, which I'm sure a lot of people thought this was an unnecessary sequel, but I think this is very underrated. And uh, this DVD is out of print, but uh, this is going to be paired with the uh, TV remake on Blu-ray next month from Screen Factory. Anyway, um, I like the storyline in it, and... Amy Irving is back as Sue Snell, and um, I liked uh, how it w the uh, destruction scene was uh, different from the prom scene, although uh, what didn't really make sen what sense was the vines uh, from the tattoo coming out of uh, Rachel, the uh, title character's uh, body when she starts to get telekinesis. And also, uh, some of the scenes, some of the kill scenes are a little bit uh, odd, like the uh, person who gets the CDs in his face, or her face, which is uh, which was stolen from Hellraiser 3. And also, um, like the scene with the uh, fire poker. And... Um, also, which there was one scene that didn't really make sense uh, with uh, Rachel's mother who uh, leaves her uh, helpless and she starts to run off. I mean, you, they don't explain what happens to her if uh, she gets killed off or not. And uh, the um, deleted scenes uh, in this on this DVD uh, doesn't uh, show what happens to her. This also has uh, Mina, an early uh, role uh, from uh, Mina Savari, who would later go on to do bigger things. And uh, one of the uh, actors from the American Pie movies, I can't remember what his name was. Anyway, I give this uh, three stars. Next up is the TV remake of Carrie from 2002, which I don't have on DVD, but... Uh, Saw it when it came out on NBC back in 2002, and it was a, a three-hour movie. And um, aside from the fact that Angela Bettis and Catherine Is Isabel's in the movie as <clears throat> Angela Bettis as the title character and Catherine Isabel as one of her tormentors, I mean the remake tv remake just didn't do anything for me i mean the effects were really really cheap and the acting was kind of bad and during the prom scene it looked like um, when she gets dumped with the pig blood it looks like someone had 
painted blood on her face and all over her body. And there's some like really bad CGI effects in it. And I just thought the ending was totally lame. And that's, uh, if I do get the Blu-ray of that, I'm just going to like watch the Rage Carry 2 and just leave that one alone. So, one star for that. And last but not least is the remake from 2013, and I have to say I enjoyed this very much. Um, Julianne Moore was pretty good as Margaret White, even though I thought Piper Laurie was much better. And I liked how it, how this uh, went by the book and uh, Brian De Palma's original. And uh, Chloe Grace Moretz does a pretty good job as the uh, title character. And also, uh, I had heard that there's a uh, website for petition to uh, get an ultimate director's cut of this uh, movie out on Blu-ray and DVD. So, I hope that it comes out because I signed it. And I also did a video on that, which uh, you could see on my channel. And uh, the prom scene was pretty good. When uh, after she gets dumped by the pig blood and uh, she uh, makes all, <clears throat> all of the uh, prom guests start to uh, fly in the air, like um, raise up in the air and then uh, like they're uh, flying, uh, like wind blowing. And also uh, at first I thought she was flying, uh, but she was just levitating. Some people may not may not have cared for this remake, but I thought it was pretty good. And the uh, character of uh, Chris in this movie is much more nastier than Nancy Allen's character. And, um, I just hope that the uh, ultimate director's cut of this movie comes out. And excellent remake. Well, that's it for this video, and I hope you all have enjoyed it. You may agree with me, and you may not. Until then, Ron here saying take care and see ya.